hey, it's a little after six in the morning. I'm at Walmart. Got a, I gotta get something for my poison. That vine was poison. I got into some vines. Man, it's not getting any better, I think. It's uh, been putting calamine on there. I saw something the other day that said that guaranteed to get rid of it is like $35. We're gonna see. Here it is. Thirty-five twenty-two. Uh, supposed to start working in thirty seconds. That's what it is. At twenty after uh, prior to that's five hours after, and that's two days after. Well, I've had it for a week. You stop. You zoom that and read it if you want to. Get the glare off of it. Pause where needed. If this can give this a shot. All right, so I used this product on some poison ivy. There's there's no ivy growing right now. The, well, I'm just saying that there's no leaves. So what I got into was a vine that had no leaves, but it still had poison in it. And it got on my skin. I used bleach. I used calamine lotion for a week and it got worse uh, but when I was getting the calamine lotion I saw this and I said well you know I got thinking about it I said I'm gonna try it and it says it washes away poison ivy oak sumac uh, relieves itching in 30 seconds uh, it comes with uh, questions and answers here it does come with a lot of information. Uh, it also says that doctors try to go to steroid shots first to give your doctor some feedback if you use this product. So I'm gonna give y'all some feedback on this. Does it work? Well, before I tell you whether it works or not, I'd just like to say that my channel is all about saving you time and money with my how-tos and reviews and uh, this was $35 and some change. I'll leave a link in the description box down below where you can find it on Amazon or you can go to your Walmart if they carry it at your Walmart. So I put this on Friday night. Uh, what you do is you put it, puts you a little bit in your hand. It says an inch and a half, get it wet. So all I did was just run my hand under the water and back out. And you want to mix it for 10 seconds. It says you can use the palm of your hand to apply it or use a rubber spatula. I used the palm of my hand and I rubbed it. So I did this on Friday night and I rubbed it in for about 30 seconds. Uh, it says you don't want to skip this part because this 10 seconds you do it at actually makes the chemicals or whatever's in there work. So I rubbed this in on my hand and right here uh, for 30 seconds. And it says to do it for 30 seconds to three minutes, depending on how bad it is. Well, mine was not that bad. I just had it in a few spots. But I got it from the vine. And they said it says in here that the vine can be 10 to 100 times more potent than just the leaves. So I did it Friday night. I woke up, I woke up Saturday morning, I put it on again. Uh, it said to reapply if needed after five hours, but I only did it for 30 seconds again. And then Saturday night, I put it on again, but this time I did it for about three minutes. All right, just nonstop rubbing. Put it on for three minutes. Once you get it on, you rinse it off. I didn't use soap or anything. I just rinsed it off with regular water. Uh, I don't really know if you can tell, but in the video, but this is just crusted over now. There's nothing, there's nothing there anymore. And what I did was I had another spot on my leg that I intentionally didn't use this stuff on because I wanted another place to experiment before I gave you my findings, my review on this product. Uh, 
So last night, I had that little spot on my leg and I took and rubbed it, this product in there for three minutes. And then this morning, it's cleared up, it's gone. I wish I'd used this. I wish I would have had this when I first saw the onset of the poison ivy, because if I did, it wouldn't have left these marks like it did, you know. See that's it's just uh that's just like a scab now. There's nothing there. And then this it's just crusted over. There's no it this was leaking. Uh, there's nothing there now. So I recommend this product 100 percent because calamine didn't work, bleach didn't work. Uh yeah, this is what I found last year. I had it so bad I had to go get a shot. I will definitely, $35 is well worth not going through what I went through this time or what I went through last year and the years before. So it comes in a little bottle like this. I'll show you what it looks like. See there? It's kind of gritty like sand. This is the ingredients. I'm not going to try to read that because I can't say those words. <laughs> Pause it if you need to. It actually even has uh, your inch and a half right here, so you know exactly how much to put on there. There's the instructions once again. All right, that's it. Thanks for watching. Thanks for stopping by. Go down in the description box down below if you want to find this on Amazon or run over to Walmart and pick it up. But it definitely, definitely worked. Well worth the money to not be in suffering because it's so bad to be itching from poison ivy so y'all have a good one now thanks for watching and you come back